So the drama begins. We got a town planner to put the rezoning application through, and then we got an array of objections. Array of objections. And then that chapter ended after a couple of months. We didn't have to go to the tribunal to sort it out, thankfully. We've already spent money to service the stand, to lay ele um, the electrical work, to lay the water pipes for the water supply, the sewer pipes, uh, the storm water reticulation, all to comply with the city of Johannesburg um, Water Department as well as the Johannesburg Roads Agency. the Johannesburg Roads Agency they require they have their certain requirements like a paving on the sidewalk as well as stormwater reticulation um, so we had done all that we already spent the money and we were in the process of constructing find the 6.5 meter mark and then it curves it curves it curves 6.5 it does it does I am exactly yeah, but also even the center won't be like here. It doesn't have to be on the wall. It could be inside the, the center point. Yeah, 6.5. Uh-huh. It, it probably has how we dimension on Revit. The center is somewhere else. It's not even on this wall. It's probably inside somewhere. No, 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 no. The center point has to be along the wall. Okay, where's six meters? Okay, just put a mark there. The last one. This is the last curve. Then. And then we. Because I think Vela, if the tree was not there, it was gonna be okay. Next, we we're gonna be able to. You know. so they wanna measure, and they give us a certificate. So if they're measuring from there, we won't get a certificate. That's so the only option is to get the get the rid of the tree. Yeah. Okay. I don't think we have a choice at this point. We were in the process of constructing the first show. for us. I mean, nine days ago, we had a TLB here digging up the foundations. The next day, we had fixers fixing the foundation steel. And the day after that, they were pouring the, the foundation concrete. 
So I'm really pretty excited because it took the guys, I think, less than three days just to build up the foundation walls. And then for the last two days, we've just been putting in services, the plumbing, the electrical, and stomping the ground. And now we're here. So this is excellent. The guys have gotten there pretty quickly. And I'm really excited. I'm really proud of them. So I can't wait to see how quickly they get to first floor level.